Guy wires. One wire steadying a radio tower stretches from a point 100 feet high on the tower to a point on the ground 25 feet from the base of the tower. How long is the wire? Step one in our five-step process is to familiarize ourselves with the problem. So I drew a rough sketch of the picture where we have the tower and actually the tower extends beyond here, but I'm only interested in this part of the triangle where it's 100 feet high, where the wire attaches to the tower, and it's 25 feet out from the base, W, which is what we'll let the length of the wire equal, would be representing this part of the triangle. So therefore, you'll see that we should use the Pythagorean theorem. Remember, the Pythagorean theorem is a squared plus b squared equals c squared. And then we replace, in this case, a with 100, so 100 squared. We replace b with 25, so 25 squared. And then we replace c, which is the hypotenuse of the triangle, with w, so it's w squared. Now, squaring 100 and then squaring the 25, we have 10,000 plus 625 equals W squared. And now adding together the 10,625, we have 10,625 equals W squared. Now, to find W, we take the square root of both sides. So we'd have the square root of 10,625 equals W. And if we use a calculator, we can approximate that as 103.078 equal to W. So we've carried out step three in the process, which is to solve the equation. And now step four would be to check our answer. You could do that by substituting the 103.078 for the C in the Pythagorean theorem, or the W here, I should say, and leaving 25 and 100 there. And of course, because this is an approximation, so first of all, let me make those approximate, we know that it won't come out exact. But if you do check, it does work, and therefore, we can say that the length of the wire is approximately equal to 103.078 feet.